What is up, Bull Nation, and welcome to today's Elden Ring video. Today we're going to be doing the Irene quest line, and this is going to be a complete walkthrough showing you guys step by step on what you need to do. So what you guys are going to do is you're going to head over to the Bridge of Sacrifice. I have this uh, checkpoint right here on the side of Grace, or this one right here. Basically, you want to go to this marker, and we're going to head to that marker right now, so you guys can know exactly what it is. So that's number three. Pull this up real quick. And we're going to head to the marker. Now, when we head to the marker, that's going to be like the entrance of the uh, of this particular, I wouldn't say castle, but the entrance of this area. She's going to be located on the, uh, I believe, if you're coming in from the uh, opposite way, she's going to be located on the right-hand side. If you're coming from the location I'm coming, I believe she will be on the left-hand side. But just to make sure, we're going to head over there right now and find out exactly where she's at. So as you guys notice, there is a side of grace right here that we're able to pick up. So you can pick this one up right here. That way you could just get this one instead of the one I showed you, or if you already have it, um, you guys should be able to go. So off of this side of Grace, you know, go this way, and she's just going to be located on the side of this road right here. We're going to jump over, and as you see, she's just chilling right there on that little tree. What we're going to do is interact with her and do her dialogue and complete her dialogue, and then we'll continue. So she's going to ask you guys after you exhaust her dialogue, she's going to say if you want to deliver the letter, let's go ahead and deliver the letter. And now she gives us the letter, and now it's for us to take the letter to her father. All right, so from this point, guys, you're going to want to travel to the Castle of Morn Lift, and this is the location where we're going to be going. This is the checkpoint that we have. Just follow me as we go there, and we are going to go and give the card to or give the letter to her father. All right, we're gonna keep going this way. What we're gonna do, guys, is once you head to this location, we're gonna hit this uh, lift, and we are gonna go to the top. Now there are gonna be a couple of enemies that you should be able to take them out. I mean, I have so many builds up on the channel uh, that you could use on here if you guys are having a hard time getting here. Uh, but we are gonna have a early build uh, for you guys that, in case you guys are barely starting the game, you should guys should be able to wreck with that build. So I'll be posting it up sometime this week. But right now, you just pretty much want to take these out. You don't really have to take them out. I'm just taking them out so you guys can get an idea of what the enemy types are and what you need to do to uh, actually complete this quest here. So we take that guy out real quick. And what's he going to do with it? What, what you going to do with it? Don't even try me, boy. Right, take this guy out. And then we got this guy. And we're pretty much good to go here. So we got this right, thing right here. We're going to acquire the material. Okay, this guy wants to play. You want to play, eh? So we're going to pick this up real quick. All right, hold on. Let me take care of that guy. And I think he's dead. Okay, so he's officially dead. So once we've done that, guys, so you're going to keep going straight. And you're going to bump into this guy. Take him out. Oh, really? This Really? This dog, yo. Okay, enough. 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 Okay, this dog is so OP. Like, what the heck? Okay, now he wants to bring his buddy in here? Bruh. Bruh, come on, man. Don't even try me, son. Get out of here. Come on. Okay. So we're going to keep going straight after you kill those hats. And when you get in here, we can actually kill this guy real quick here. Okay, so that guy's dead. We're going to keep going this way. And you're going to notice that there is a ladder going up. Go up the ladder. And this is where we're going to meet her father. So not that many big of enemies. They're easy to take care of. We're just going to keep going up this ladder. Work our way up here. And then once we get up here... There are going to be, uh, I believe there's going to be like a couple, like three or four enemies. Well, how does that guy not die? I hate when that doesn't hit. All right, so take that guy out right here. Now, the one you want to worry about is the one on top. Because he, he, these are flying ones and these are annoying. So you kind of just want to take them out real quick. Okay, so take that guy out. So after you kill those guys, what you want to do is make a left. You're going to see this thing right here. What you want to do is just jump down here and work your way to this part of the castle right here. There's going to be more ads, uh, but they're kind of fighting each other. So you kind of just could just let them kill each other or you could just help them, you know, kill them. So what we're going to do is we're going to do that and kill this guy real quick. And kill that guy. And that guy should be dead and everybody's dead. All right. So once we kill all these guys, we're going to work our way up here. And just go around this door right here, work your way up here, go through here. And then her dad is going to be located right here. Talk to him, exhaust his dialogue, and then we'll continue to the next step. So he's going to give us a sacrificial twig. We're going to accept, and now we're going to deliver Irene's letter. All right, so after you get talking to him and you give him the letter, you're going to have to go back, guys, and we actually have to kill a boss. Now, to get to this boss, it might be a little bit uh, confusing if you don't follow this guide. But I'm going to show you guys exactly how to get it completed 
and uh, be able to get it done quickly. So we're going to go up this ladder right here. And the cool thing about this part is we're going to actually be able to hit a side of grace. So that's what makes it really good. So you don't have to worry if you're, you know, if you lost health or you haven't lost health. So we're going to go to this part right here. Look for that uh, kind of fire right there. You know, jump down here. And this is where the side of grace is. Pick up this side of grace because we're going to definitely need to come back to this side of grace um, after we kill the boss. Okay, it's going to be really important because we, we're going to have to come back to this location. So just best time, make sure you have everything, everything ready to go. And then we should be good. All right, so now from this part right here, we are going to go work our way down this area. Now, I don't know if you can call No, you can't summon your torrent. Okay, so we just got to keep going down, guys. Basically, that's what it's all about. Keep working our way down. Now, just follow the same path that I'm taking to make your way down here. So it's just a matter of you taking these uh, these little flight of stairs down here without a problem. Go down here. All right, don't worry about those ads. Edges are good to go. We're going to keep going this way. And I, I think we can automatically run to these guys without a problem, so we should be good. Okay, so we just want to keep going down here, working our way down to the bottom, land on this little rooftop, all right? And we're going to keep going, land on this part right here, keep going. Yep, so basically it's just a matter of trying to get to the bottom of this, uh, this castle because the boss is behind this area. Just keep going here. And... I believe we could actually drop down here or I, I don't know. I think I think if I remember correctly now, you would probably take fall damage. So what we want to do, guys, is just kind of work our way down here. Go down this here part right here. Make sure you pick up the stuff that's here. Spinning stone could help at the uh, late, uh, late game here. Early game, I should say. Go down here. Okay. Okay, so we were actually lucky. We landed on that one. Okay, so these, these, these rats are a bit annoying. We're going to kill these rats real quick because we want to see what's down here. Okay, and take this guy out real quick. All right, so that guy's dead, and then we're gonna pick this up real quick. All right, was this a whip? Bring out the whip, boys. All right, so now that we got here, we're gonna head across this bridge, but where we really wanna go is we wanna go to that part right there and, and kill that boss. So what we're gonna do here is just pick this up. Pick this up, some daggers. There's another one. Okay, so he's dead. Okay, and now we're just gonna jump down. And now that we drop down, kind of avoid that real quick. Hit this part right here. And let's go ahead and kill this dude. So for this guy, we shouldn't really have to have a problem with killing this guy. I'm pretty sure we just pull out our mimic. And then we're gonna use this real quick. And we're gonna use it. Okay, well, calm down. I'm kind of okay. Okay, calm down, buddy. Uh, let's hit him up. Oh, he's gonna get lucky. He's gonna get lucky, isn't he? All right, don't disappear from me, boy. Really? Really, game? Okay, okay, calm down. Calm down, buddy. Okay, okay. There we go. That should pretty much end his career. And he's dead. I kind of let him get away with too much. So we got the uh, Grafted Blade Great Sword, which is a legendary sword, which is actually pretty dope. All right, guys, so you're going to work your way back to the area where we talked to her dad. So just, you know, fast travel to the, uh, the starting point where we first came, and then just come and meet her dad again. And talk to him again. So once you're done exhausting his dialogue, now it's on to the next step. Alright, so once you're exhausted his dialogue, guys, we are going to travel back to the location where this all began. Which is down here, guys. We're just going to go to the Bridge of Sacrifice. Hit OK. And we're going to go talk to her once again. So, you know, we gave you, we gave your father the letter. Uh, we helped him kill a, uh, you know, like a mini boss. And uh, she'll be like, what's your mind? You helped him. I'll be like, well, we did help him. Come on now. Oh, that tree's too well picked. So we're going to go to the same area right here. But unfortunately, guys, <coughs> she won't be here. Sad, sad, sad. But he will be here. So let's talk to him. Nothing happened to her. That Her daughter did not deserve that. So he's a little bit upset. But we're going to solve this issue. Just just exact the dialogue and you should be good to go to the next step. All right. So for the next part of the quest line, guys, we have to go to this location right here called the Converted Tower. And we're going to head to this marker right here. That is the main place where we're heading to. So let's head on over there. 
Now we're gonna get invaded by a uh, NPC or a you know really one of those little red dudes, and we're gonna want to kill him as quickly as we possibly can. So let's go ahead, summon our torrent, and head to the location right here, which should lead us to uh, the part where we really want to go. Now I believe there is a side of grace around here, so you might want to hit that side of grace. If I bump to it on my way over here, we'll pick it up. Uh, but you definitely want to hit it just in case uh, you know you're playing the game and you probably want to come and do this another time. This quest line. As long as you have that side of grace, it'll be a lot easier for you to access it instead of taking this long uh, pathway to the uh, to the location. So let's keep going through here. There really isn't that many ads or enemies to fight, so you should be good to go here. And we're going to head to this location, and he should be spawning pretty soon. So we just want to make sure we, we head to the right location. All right, so once you're in the location I marked on the map, you're going to have to go a little bit further up to right here. So that's why I kind of wanted to mark just so you know where to go. You know, look for these kind of things that look like if you were playing Halo. Just head in here. And as you head in here, there's going to be some little shacks that you want to uh, kind of just sit in here. And here's the side of grace I was talking to you guys about. We're going to hit this side of grace and get ready for a fight once we're able to do that. So let's hit it. Make sure we take the side of grace. Make sure you restore everything, your health, your uh, FP, everything you can once you get to this location. And as you guys saw, as I was trying to explain this and make this guy, this guy decided to invade me. What the heck is going on, brother? And that should pretty much get him as soon as we kill him. We should be good, and we're going to acquire the material, and he's going to drop us all of this stuff, guys. He's going to drop us a lot of stuff right here. He's going to the Banch Knight Hellberg and all that good stuff. So once we did this, guys, we are pretty much done, and we completed the quest line.